Who's here? <gasps> Whoa! Oh. How did Hi. you see that? <laughs> just, it, it took me so long. I had to <laughs> sign in and click make an avatar. Oh <laughs> my god, this is so funny! <gasps> oh, the Hawaiian tropics have arrived in oh. the chat. <gasps> Oh my god, I could do I could do <laughs> Oh that. my god, I am losing my mind. This is so funny. You can't be, my hand. be boo Hi. boy. Be boo boy at, at Hollywood Studios. Hi everybody. <laughs> I am Boo Boy reporting live from Jolly Bee Nights. Welcome to my favorite um this is my favorite park in the Walt Disneyland. <laughs> What the hell is happening? <laughs> what Boo Boy! Boo Boy's in studio! He's at, he's at Jollywood Nights right now. Boo uh, Boy, we'll get you through that, that Jollywood, line. you shouldn't even be by Tip Top Club because you don't... You don't oh, you're too young. He, he's oh, in line oh, for no. his Tita. Where's, where's Tita? I can't find Tita. <laughs> What is that? How did you do this? I don't know, but I'm so. Is it obsessed. AI companion? Hi, guys. This is actually an AI. RJ can't be here today. Oh, the audio girls are loving this. Oh, no, oh. that's no, no, not the AI no. companion. Oh, well, then, then what is, is it, girl? <laughs> it's an avatar, girly. Where? Quaharini. Quaharini. <laughs> oh. Video oh. settings? <laughs> yeah, in video settings, you can click choose avatar. But I had to make one. While you were trying to connect to Twitch, I, ma I spent that time making one. Wow. Oh, sh we, don't have it on, we don't have it on the one on, the, on our desktop, I guess. She's not that advanced. Step is the bros. Hey, what's up, dude? This would be so funny if I was on an edible. I would be cackling right now. Uh, okay. No more edible. edibles on cruise lines, if case well, anybody was wondering. Well, thank you. The, the, did you hear that? <laughs> I hope none of that made it into the top uh, of the episode. It's, it's time to ask the most important question of the week. Did you read the group chap? Did you, read the, the Did you read the group chat? Hi, girlies. Hi. We're all four in separate areas. Yes. In the I'm same in house. <laughs> in the same I'm house. In <laughs> it's, it's, uh, it's, what is that? The circle. Oh, yeah. The, the circle. circle. The circle. Oh, yeah. It's the circle. I'm currently in line at Pizza Rizzo waiting for my mobile order to be called so I can go up and get my. A uh, large Diet Coke and my pizza is a cookie. That's my virtual backdrop. And it looks like RJ's at the new Tip Top Club at yes. uh -huh. Jollywood Nights at Disney's Hollywood he's, Studios. He's I'm still in line. My, I'm still in line just waiting to get my Angry Orchard. <laughs> Girlies. Jollywood Nights. Girlies. Have you girlies. been on social? Have you read your group chat? About Jollywood Nights over the weekend. Can you give us a quick run to a PR, a boilerplate of what Jollywood Nights is? Yes. Before we Me? discuss anyone. Yeah, we'll have you, I mean, Mar Miranda do it. Okay. So Jollywood okay. Nights is a new ticketed, special ticketed event. Oh, I don't have... I don't have a background. I'm not doing a background. But your background a new is your Christmas tree. It's up. It is. It's true. And all of my ear options for my trip next week that I have to figure out. Um, I laid them all out. Jollywood Nights is a special ticketed event, brand new to Disney's Hollywood Studios. And it is basically an extra holiday party that they are adding to the Walt Disney World Resort. Now, these tickets are more expensive than Mickey's Very Merry Christmas Party, which famously takes place at Magic Kingdom. And it begins, it, it runs from 8.30 to, I want to say 12.30. 12.30 every night. And they only have like a handful of parties. I think there were only like 10 or 11 parties throughout. The first one was November 11th, and it runs through the holiday season. So through the end of December. Sorry, um, wait, which one? You're talking about Jollywood Nights runs every night? Yes. Or no, runs 10 no, nights? No, no, no. 
there's only 10 or 11 okay. of them like a smaller okay. amount um but, but it's again the expensive? first yes yes the tickets are 189 dollars oh, i think they also God. not I mean, all of them are can, sold out nothing is included in your in, part ticket you can start you can getting, start getting it at seven seven <laughs> so an, okay. an hour and a half before the um, unless you're unless you're a day guest uh, and then whatever unless you're a day yes and let me tell you what is special about this event so they're really they were really marketing it up as basically like lots of food options lots of drink options and entertainment options yeah. so there are two shows one of them involving the muppets and bell and other people muppets and then being kermit and miss piggy yeah yeah. Um, and then a Nightmare Before Christmas show. So those are the two shows. And then they talked about entertainment throughout. So there are like live musicians everywhere. And they, are they doing, they're doing, doing Jingle Bell, Jingle Bam, right? As the yes. fireworks show? Jing and Jingle Bell, Jingle Bam as the fireworks. Though I hear that, um, what's the show that happens RJ, on why are you that? so low? Yeah, what's happening? <laughs> I so low we can't hear you. Because I'm eating a sandwich under. Oh, excuse me. Uh, excuse me. Where the um, question? Excuse, um, excuse me. Excuse me. Is this where the tip top club is? <laughs> and so then they also, yes, have special <laughs> areas the that they've created, like the tip top club, which is outside of Tower of Terror, that has special beverages. They redid um, Hollywood Brown Derby for special beverages and snacks throughout the night and like basically made virtual cues for those uh-huh we'll get um, into it we'll get into it but and then obviously like rides are open so but i'm gonna tell you right and now there's, girl, there's some there character rides. character greetings as well uh, character meet and greets as well so just but, so i remember because i don't know if things have changed since the last time i only i only think i went to a very merry once actually I've only been to one Very Merry. Very Merry, as far as I remember, was like six to close, which is usually like 12 or whatever. Seven, and, seven to midnight. Oh, it's seven to midnight. And you could get in it. I think back in the day, you could get it at four. Okay. Four. That's still the case. Okay. So a little bit different. Um, there's a parade. Mm -hmm. the, the, the entertainment offerings are the, well, they don't do dream lights anymore. We know dream lights is dead. But there is a, there is a, a projection show. show. Yeah. Okay. Um. There's the fireworks. There's a very merry fireworks. Holly, Holly, Holly. Wait, was it something wishes? Holly, holiday wishes. Sure. There's the fireworks. <laughs> there's the parade. There's the a castle, show. A castle show. Like where on the Clara stage. Bell sings "All I Want for Christmas Is You." Iconically. Uh -huh. And they are there and they still multiple dance parties. Christmas. There are still dance parties happening in okay. areas around Cosmic and Ray. This is, and this is cheap. I just am clear. Well, I want to be really clear on this. This is cheaper than Hollywood Studios. And you also get cookies and cocoa at multiple locations in the park. And it is $10 cheaper. Okay. Okay. I just wanted to make sure we had all the facts and figures in front mm -hmm. of us. We do. Mm -hmm. You're going next week, correct? I am going in two weeks. Two I weeks. will be there on the evening of the 27th is my... Are you Jollywood basically night. flying straight from there to Disneyland? <laughs> is that what's happening? Or is there yes. like a week in between? There Technically, there's a weekend in between. Okay. But I couldn't, in good, in good faith, I couldn't come home on Tuesday night and leave on Thursday morning. It was just not in the cards for me. But sure. I do, in my brain, I am doing a coast to coast celebration. Sure. Yeah. You know, um, Seeing all of your friends. It's also my mom's birthday that. Oh, weekend, right, right, right. So if I like left, it's the family trip. She wouldn't like that. Um, but yeah, so Jollywood nights, the first one was on Saturday. It was a sold out event. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Period. Was that a burp, RJ? Oh no, I moved my. Oh. I moved my because I was over here typing and, and it looked funny, so I was trying to move it, and then it made a noise. Mm, okay. So it was a sold out event, sold and out event. Um, <laughs> I'm sorry. And the night at the night of, I started seeing a couple little grumblings about check in lines, and then check not then line. like 
uh, I went to the movies and and I didn't hear anything else. But then the next day is when all of the everything started. To all the TikTok, to the all the reels, all the whatever. Came all I to. saw, all I saw that night was I saw the check in line. I saw the line for the Muppets show that like stretched all the way down Sunset. But also, like, Theater of the Stars doesn't have, like, queue space. So that makes sense. Um, and it does seat a lot of people, so I'm sure it was fine. Um, and then I just saw, like, a couple people be like, I really don't like to say negative things, but I cannot in good conscience recommend buying tickets in its current state. And that's all I saw. Yeah. And then the next day it was like, doom, gloom, boom. So that's yeah. I, that was my <laughs> social media experience. Yeah. And so I did a little um a little research for the pod. I well, cuz you're there. You're right there yeah, in uh, Pizza Rizzo. I've been working from Pizza Rizzo all week to bring you this news. <laughs> my laptop is still logged in upstairs. Still in plugged into the banquet. <laughs> um and I will say that the that I I watched some YouTubers and the first YouTube I watched was some obnoxious man, some obnoxious white man that was like on YouTube. Disney's. I know. I didn't expect it either. Shocking. <laughs> he's like, he's like Disney's worst event ever or something like that. You oh know? my, I get, I can see the thumbnail right yeah. now. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And so he goes through the event. Yeah. And okay. Here's, here's one thing. <laughs> If you are the first to go to an event, just know you're the guinea pig. Just know that you are you're going to be the one that's going to that's going to either get the good or the bad, you know? Because they're either going to do something and be like, "Oh, we can't do it like that anymore." Or that it's going to be bad and then it'll get fixed by the time, you know. But anyway, so you're a guinea pig. And if you want to be first in content, then this is what you get, mama. You're going to get this stuff. But yeah, so the complaint was checking in inside the park was taking 40 minutes to get your thing because they had one, one place open to do that. So people were literally exiting the park and coming back in. And they, and like I watched another YouTuber, like just some like, uh, to me, she's a no-name. I don't know. She doesn't have that many followers, but she was like, we just exited and went back in. It took two minutes. Like, because they just like at the tick at the not turnstiles, but at the at taps. the gate. Yeah. 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 At the taps. Okay. Um, so she's like, it was just way easier to do that, I guess. But anyways, so that was the first thing. Um, the the Brown Derby. <laughs> was a virtual queue and what happened was is you would have to go up to the brown derby and starting at 8 15 it would be active to join the like virtual queue and so there was literally people standing like the cast members standing outside of the brown derby with qr codes on a saw on like a you know a thing and you would take a picture of it and at 8 15 you could try and join the virtual queue but if you were too far away, like say you say you you scan, you took a picture of it and you were going to like mm -hmm. go stand out to the side to do it away from the crowds. It wouldn't work. You had to be right there in the middle with everyone. And, you know, that little space where the Brown Derby is not famously yeah. not a very big, spacious spot, not like spacious, precious. Um, not it like is spacious, not, precious. Our dear it friend, is, mm -hmm. my dear friend, it is. A little spot and so um and the people were getting quoted 10 minutes and they weren't getting called back for two and a half hours and didn't be and also this was because everybody who got it everybody said 10 minutes oh all of their God. things oh. said 10 minutes so this okay and that was for the hollywood brown <laughs> that derby was, that that's was like you go in just basically like yeah you go, you in go to eat, you but sit down a piano player playing Although Jingle someone bells. said like they're Jingle playing, <laughs> someone was like, they said that they're playing like dis just Disney songs right now. Like it's not even Christmas songs. Oh my God. But it's like so decorated. It's, it's the little, it's the little guy outside Casey's corner. 
but in a little yeah, Santa. But in Grayson, <laughs> it's Grayson. <laughs> we love Grayson in this. We house. love Grayson. So qu- in this just, house. just I don't know, Casey, if you have the shrimp cocktail available. Do you know what I'm talking about? No. Do you, Miranda? Do you know the shrimp cocktail I'm talking about? Did they offer a shrimp cocktail at Brown Derby? Yes. So there was a shrimp cocktail offering. Um, I believe it was sixteen dollars or something like that. You, I'm dizzy pricing. It's fine. Whatever. That's your appetizer. Yeah. Um, I was hoping to find the tweet. I can't. I'm not gonna search for it right now. Only because I wanted to see RJ's reaction. The shrimp cocktail had three. Oh, I'm pieces looking at a of- picture. Three pieces of shrimp on a glass, and that was the shrimp cocktail. So I maybe it wasn't sixteen; it might have been fourteen. Um, but um, not not great. Yikes. Okay, I'm looking at a photo right now, and it looks <laughs> so <laughs> funny. Like it's these three <laughs> shrimp cocktails. Here, I'm gonna put it the into the at least into our chat. I could put it into the other chat. Oh, here. We we can um, put it in Twitch. Casey, here. I'll let you, I'll let you share if you want. Oh sure, let me oh, share. Oh girly, who can share? All participants can share. Share screen. Anyone can share. Share screen. Share screen. Okay, I'm. Sh- oh share. my god. <laughs> Look how like look how like obscene this looks. Thirteen yeah, looks... dollars. Like this looks. Yeah, thirteen dollars. So and... that's that's about four four dollars per, per over four dollars per piece of shrimp. What is this? Granted, the stuff? shrimp looks really large. No, no, they don't. I don't think they. <laughs> they I, don't. Those do not look that like jumbo like... shrimp. That's normal shrimp cocktail you buy from Cost Kirkland's frozen shrimp cocktail. Like, Girly, that is not tray. Kirkland's. That is ab- no, it is larger than a Kirkland's tray. Let's, not four dollars worth. Okay. Oh, that see. French seventy five looks delish though. Oh, look at that babe. I love a French. The sliders uh, look good. The Derby sliders look yummy. Sliders look great. Aren't those the regular? Don't they serve those normally, or do they just add blackberry? Because I know that during Maybe. the day, I think outside they have um, sliders. But honestly, yeah, like, okay, so I, and I'm, listen, I am, I have purchased, I, okay, I have purchased tickets to this event. So I mm-hmm. am still, I have this positive outlook. Yeah. Okay? yeah. Yeah. I was not planning on even trying to go to Hollywood Brown Derby. No. Like, first of all, an 830 event. Why would I go and sit down for, for dinner. an hour? For dinner. Gonna, like, it's going to be an yeah. hour minimum. Right. Like, and I haven't even, lo- I I mean, I perused the snacks and drinks, which apparent those lines were also very long. But let me tell you this. Okay. It was, okay, okay listen, it was <laughs> opening night of a brand new event where every single content creator in Central Florida was there buying every single fucking you menu know. item. Yeah. Literally, they are all there ordering everything. So of course lines are going to be longer because yeah. y'all are Why battling do... them who can cover what and ordering did... as much as you possibly can. Why didn't they do like a media night or something like that? Like a press night or whatever. Or like a cast member. Preview. Or literally, truly anything as a trial run. Yeah. It's frustrating um, because, of course, there are going to be hiccups. I mean, we can keep talking about this, but of course, there are going to be hiccups on the first night. It's just frustrating when it's like, yes, totally, but also you aren't. It's this isn't your first day at the rodeo, Walt Disney Company. You do this ev- so many times for the last like three months at Magic Kingdom. I get that it's not the same park; it's a different cast, but like. I just refuse to believe that with decades of experience, they really can't just figure out that we need more than one person to check people in in the park. Like there's, yeah, there's so many Star little Wars things nights. that are so clearly like a problem. Yeah, and like I'm, I will say, Hollywood Studios is known for doing like Star Wars nights, after hours events, you know, DVC, mm-hmm. DVC events. Um, they do they they always host you know a lot of those like. Like I've I've seen like cheerleading, you know, like big like the when the big cheerleading mm-hmm. companies come, there's like 
they do after hours stuff with them. It's like it's not like this park isn't used to after hours events or special events. Like you right. know, like it's it's that. And then yeah, the the first night is always going to be you're you're the guinea pig. You shouldn't expect. I mean, for that price, uh, that's what a lot of people are saying is like we yeah. expect the greatness. But the problem is, is uh, here or here's the thing that is so funny is that like so the the YouTuber that did this um did this video it's gotten probably 50,000 views by now he tweeted yesterday that he like talked to guest relations and he got a full refund so you got a full refund but you also got a f- video full- filled with content that is getting just eaten up like you know you've already made your money back from views on this mm-hmm. video but you also get your money back because you complain. But it's like, but that's not going to stop you from going to these events because you need that content. Like, this is like, a, honestly, this is a content creator's like wet dream, you know? Because it's mm-hmm. like, I was there for the shit show, blah, blah, blah. So it's, I don't feel bad for content creators. I feel bad, f- you know, obviously, you know, I feel bad for the the family that's like, oh, this is great. But at the same time, I watched this other lady do it. And she was also doing content creation, whatever. But, like, she did the Muppet show. She did the sing-along. She mm-hmm. got some food. And she saw some, like, of the live entertainment. And she got this, oh, the Gertie cookie. That's just a sugar cookie at the little Gertie stand. Was taking people 40 minutes. That's crazy. That. All they're selling is the cookie. Like that should be at every that should be is at it shaped like Gertie. Yeah. Does it look yes, like oh that one? Yes, it is. It's yeah. It's like Gertie Santa, but it's Gertie. it does it's giving it's giving um nailed it on the actual photo. She looks a little that she looks gorgeous there, like uh-huh. plumped, you know, freshly manicured. Billard, yeah. Billard. Yeah. And the actual picture, she looks she needs she needs to gouache a little bit on her neck. <laughs> she looks a little lumpy. But it's so stupid that why is that line 40 minutes though? It's like you should honestly just be like, hey, click this link and like just buy it in the app and then show us that and you then bought just pick it. it up. Honestly, yeah. that should be that should have been something that was included. Like on your way out, everybody gets a little everybody oh, gritty yeah. cookie in just a bag. A like can I ask add, qu- add five dollars to tickets, no one will know. Can I ask a question? For $189? Yeah. Like, um so nothing so it's everything is basically sunset boulevard hollywood boulevard echo lake animation courtyard all that area there's nothing like grand avenue there's nothing toy story land there's nothing star wars land well there is there in the grand avenue the the area to grand avenue like a to c commissary over to grand avenue yeah there is um some entertain some live music entertainment okay um and it's like latin inspired christmas stuff okay so you have, like, you've got some yeah you've got s- all the food over there is like um you know like like latin food it's 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 you've got you know you got a little hispanic christmas yeah you know? it's like the abc commissary has empanadas and tacos and Mexican hot cocoa cheesecake. So it's and a commissario. Mine's got th- a beer margarita. Oh, intriguing. Uh, um, mm, maybe she's yeah. making a little trip. But no, nothing. Make- but like nothing to pull people far away and like disperse Correct. the crowds. Correct. Okay. So <laughs> when when I'm going in two weeks, mm-hmm. that will be the. Mm-hmm. It'll be the. F- fourth party mm-hmm. which is not When's a lot the, when is the second one because the second saturday the second so one will be saturday different definitely saturday. because it won't be it won't be the first night the second mm-hmm. one will be different because they have seven days to receive all these complaints and give all these meeting. refunds and, and seven days to fix something. Just make it and better. And getting more bit. cast members, mm-hmm. putting out those empty shifts, getting that covered. Getting that cue line ready. Getting everything Getting the tape ready, ready So on it the will ground. be very interesting. But when I am going, it is also a night that D23 offered a special ticket to a uh, pizza rizzo portion of the event so there's going to be food and drinks in pizza rizzo so we were able to get tickets for that 
as well. Was it so an additional cost? It, sure. Wh- not that much. <laughs> I honestly don't even remember because I bought it so long ago. Um, so that's also something that will be different. But Will it be in the ballroom? I believe so. Oh, that's Which nice. is very exciting. Yeah. Um, the thing that I was most looking forward to that I did hear incredible feedback for, I cannot wait to hear Belle sing her Christmas song. Yeah. yeah. Like that's when I, that, when I, when I heard that, I was like, I'm buying tickets to this event. I mean, I would Belle have sings. Seen... So this is Christmas war is over, right? That's what she said. Yes. That's classic. Famously. <laughs> they, she brings John, John Lennon now. It's yeah. a whole thing. Beautiful. Wow. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Paul but, McCartney, and, but yeah. <laughs> and who do they have? Seen? Whatever. No, it's John the Lennon Christmas... and Coco. You Who's said John have... Legend. I said John Lennon. She said John Lennon. I didn't think it was oh. John Lennon. It's John who Lennon. And, it's John Lennon and Coco. Oh, yeah. I thought you said John Legend. I'm like, sure, go John, ahead. Yeah. John Legend and Chrissy Teigen and <laughs> Bell. Yes, <said> Bell. <laughs> Happy Christmas. Wrong. Not, War is over. I was. I've only. I think I've only. Heard Do you the... know how many Sirius XM holiday stations I have on? This is that I just... missed Christmas. Okay. This song is older than I thought it was. Yeah. I think I've anyway, only ever heard the Paul, Paul McCartney so, one. So wrapping up this talk, I we will be doing a post review Our on okay. Close okay. Friends mm-hmm. coming in December. So, and I will not hold back. Can you make yeah. sure to show your slides like a yeah. vacation? Yeah. I'll, I'll maybe, I'll, maybe I'll do a, a vlog too. Like a, maybe I'll vlog only for, like I'll keep it private on YouTube. No, girl, get those views, mama. Does the, like girl, it, does the Lightning McQueen e- yes. e- experience still exist? It does. Yeah. I just put it on a client's itinerary yesterday, actually, because they're Aww. like, they like cars. And I was like, huh, let me check. And I go, it is, in fact, wow. still up and running. They but... could they could do, they could have done a little overlay over there. Yeah. A little Cute. Cars Christmas moment. Yeah. So, so, yeah. So, in my research, I will just say, Oh, and we uh, we didn't even talk about what nonsense happened at the Tip Top Club. Oh, the Tip Top Club. Oh, right oh my God. The, the, the buzz okay. going on back yeah, here. The buzz. So, the buzz. so they, it's called like the Twilight Shore so- right. So- 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 <laughs> Twilight Shore right. Twilight Shore Um. So they have some live music, a live, you know, see, it's, it's, but then they're like, oh, we're going to have drinky drinks. So they open. Pre-made open, drinky drinks. Yes. They open the gates to the, to the back. Open your open gates. Open your gates. They open those big gates that used to be where character Palooza would happen. Mm-hmm. And there is just a drink cart and like God. one, one person taking money and one person pouring and they've got. They were trying to build a make a line with all the people that were gathered over there. Some people are trying to get stuff from the Joffrey's cart that is open, which at this point just close it. Why? Like just it's close it. Up. Some people are trying to get stuff from the Joffrey's cart. Some people were in line for the thing. Some people are watching the live entertainment or whatever. So all for these three drinks that you know, yeah, are they look so nice in the photos? But I mean, they're in like a plastic flute. When you get it, mm. um, but I mean, they weren't like I. Don't, and I'm thinking, I think just because of Disney prices, I'm like, oh, like this cocktail is only nine fifty. Like that's not bad. Um, so yeah, so that was a um, a nightmare as well. But the, was the actual crime is like you know what that name symbolizes. Everyone you know? wants to yeah. the tip, go the inside club to be real. This is not yes. what people are envisioning, girl. Yeah, like everyone wants to do this. So if 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 that's the case, then let's 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 not have either not have the ride going, which they need the ride. Yeah, to, uh, eat up some people. But it's like they've got that area where they could make this tip top club. Um, but yeah, but instead they did this, which at this point it's like just don't do it. Just don't, just do, don't it. do it. Don't do it. It's also it's like a it's very hard to do. There's very there's like no traffic flow over there because it's like a it's a dead end. It's a dead end, and it's an exit for a massive ride. Yeah, yeah. 
So oh, it was oh, oh, oh. it was a mess. So I think what the here so from everything that I've consumed, mm-hmm. um, I think the key is is like one. It's like don't stand in line for the Gertie cookie. It's just a cookie. Yeah. Um. Two. Yeah. Like I'd say skip the skip actually trying to get drinks from there. Like just get them on Sunset Boulevard. You know. Um. And it yeah, it looked like the shows weren't hard to get into. It like the like you could just walk into like the Muppets, you know, show because that's a huge area. And then also the the Nightmare Before Christmas sing along looked cute because they have the Jack puppet and Oogie Boogie comes out. It's twenty minutes. Go go have a seat. Um, but they did say that the lines were so long for rides and stuff. Um, but the, the I will say the like Fab Five characters, the lines didn't look line long for those because it's in like the Disney Junior area, where those have like short ish queues. You know, it's like it's not like yeah. But um, but yeah. So I would say yeah, focus on the foods that you want. Um, but it did seem that the food that was at Fairfax Fair was taking forever as well. A long line for that, whatever food that was. Fair but facts, w- fair were there was. were there special characters out? Not um, just girls, had, girlies in costumes. They but. had Phineas and Ferb in Santa hats. Okay. Fair they had Fair Rescue had Rangers. The, that's cute. Okay. Had the holiday turkey popover, which apparently was very good. And I will say that I did want the mistletoe martini, which is oh. one of my favorite drinky drinks, which is Tito's and St. Germain. With then cranberry juice and fresh cranberries, but you know what? That's mm. okay. You know what they should have had. You know who they should have had out and about for meet and greets. First time Tell ever, me. a who? Bernard from Santa Claus. Mm. Oh, Mama, that would have been a three-hour been... line. And they could have promoted the stupid little show. Yeah, because he's in it, yeah. right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Wow. Well, but yeah, it looks like the shows well, are gonna be fine, and and it looked like there was no line at Pizza Rizzo's. Pizza Rizzo, yo, Pizza Rizzo, Pizza Rizzo. Well, Miranda Pizza will have Rizzo. a line at Pizza Rizzo. <laughs> <laughs> She'll keep the party going. Yeah, honestly. She'll bring in. Also, like I'm upset because I didn't even think about it when I was planning my outfit. Like I didn't realize it should have been like holiday sequins. You know, but, like I should have gone. It, but it's. The- Here's the thing, Miranda. Everyone's in sequins. You want to stand That's out. That's true. Wear a velour no. tracksuit. I'm doing. Wear the jean. Wear the genie outfit. I could. Wear the genie. <laughs> I, I couldn't. I can't wear a mask. Can't wear. Um. Oh. I, I'm going for a gingerbread Luke. Which um. the Miranda the the mascot of Jollywood Nights is a gingerbread. Oh, that's it. That's, it's the yeah, first. The, it's the first original the, character since Figment. Since Figment. Yeah, it's wow. true. Well, Facts. how exciting for me. Facts. But I think yes. I think you'll have a great time. I honestly, I, everybody who was complaining, I was like, okay, yeah, but like, I love. I don't know. Like, I it didn't deter me in any way. It didn't disappoint me i was glad that i don't have any clients going to the party Mm -hmm. all my clients are doing very merry yeah which the tried and true the tried tried and and true true. you you know what you're getting you know it's a classic it's yeah it's great um so i am happy i didn't have to (laughs) deal with that but for myself and jace and the group of us that are going i'm not worried wait your whole family's going too no, no, no! My family oh my will be God. long, long gone, and it will like, be a oh, no. uh, uh-uh. uh, no. They don't so. seem the Jollywood type. I don't. I don't think it would be the vibe. No. So. Yeah, I do feel like they came up with this event because they were like Jollywood is too good to pass. It's up. too good. The concept is precious. All the like, art is incredible. Spe- spacious, I love precious. it. It's spacious, spacious. precious. No, it's I think. Pagan. Yeah. No, it's what's sad. It's, what's truly sad is that it would have been truly Jollywood magical if the Osborne lights were still there. That was like, that's oh, what made it. And that that's was what made that was studios the, included the in park go. admission. That was and just that was part just of your part ticket. of it, girl. 
It was oh. so I and I only went once and you guys took me on my birthday. Remember that? Yeah. <gasps> wow. Adam and I went a few We're, times. Just to be like, let's just go. Let's look at the girls. Let's give them a look. It was let's still never it still was never cold enough to like have hot cocoa in yeah. it, but I went you know. We were there. Dead. I jingle definitely bell, went. Bell, the way. They they used to have um the baby from from dinosaur. From dinosaur. He was in. One oh my god! Uh, I forgot yes. about that. One of the windows. Uh, yep. Use it truly guys. is so upsetting. Use guys merchandise. Use guys merchandise. Man, uh, man, those were the days. Those yeah, were. But the days. we did get baseline tap house from it. We so. did get baseline. <laughs> yeah, it's true. I never. I was not a fan of the writers' stop. Sue me. I, I liked the I liked the rider <laughs> stop. I liked the rider stop, and I liked the what was that like? What was that? I like the sci-fi dining too. Honestly, I just don't know if they've done anything new to their menu. No, or anything. they haven't. No, they have. It's, it's still the, same. the same girl, and it's like a pain in the ass to get reservations because yeah. oh their capacity. That's another all one the that they could have easily the swapped yeah. out to be like all Christmas trailers or something like yes. that. Because be they've so done it cute. with like Star Wars before, they yes. swapped it up. Yeah. <sighs> cool. Well, congrats to everybody involved. Congrats to the girls. Mm -hmm. All right. Well, I'm leaving Hollywood Boulevard. Yeah. Bye. Yeah. yeah. Here, I'm getting out of Pizza Rizzo. I'm leaving Jolly from Jolly Bee Nights. This is Boo Boy. <laughs> Bye, Bye, Boo Boy. <gasps> Reporting oh live. The Remember reporting these? Lab. <gasps> yeah. I forgot about our little backgrounds. It just didn't work with two. Yeah, it didn't work with two. Anyway. Did you have one? Um, I don't even know if I still have it. I yeah, I just mine. can't believe it's already November 14th. Like, it's just I, the day of recording. It's November 14th. November 16th when this comes out. We're, like, in the thick of it. But it's been, like... Has it been warm Into in Chicago? It. Into the thick of it? It's been like chilly, not like cold, cold, but it's been like. It's been like cold. 65, 70 degrees over the past week and a half. And I'm like. Today I didn't wear a coat. I just had my. Big I don't even on. know how to go about. Be, be in winter anymore. Like, I'm like, other... I don't want to decorate for Christmas because it's, it's still fall. But I'm like, you I still to. did, though. It's. Do you. Because. It is a multi-day situation <laughs> for me. Yes. I am not kidding. As it is so that, stressful. Yeah. As someone, someone that had multiple trees, down, Miranda. Uh, I couldn't. Like, just taking down my Halloween, I'm like, I need a cleanse from, like, decorations right now. I can't do Christmas, right, at this moment. That's a, I did take Halloween down immediately and then finally did Christmas starting Saturday into Sunday. It was just... I did... I did buy some trees. Do you want to see? I did buy a Christmas tree. Oh, yeah, let's show see them. Oh, oh, those are the most beautiful. Is that a Douglas fir? <laughs> no, and it's then a, I also found this. I took a picture a of it. And Deborah it fir. But yes, I got a Deborah Christmas tree cake box. And then they also had these North Pole Nutty Buddies. Oh, Ooh, you'll have to, I've you'll never seen do a those. taste test. Yes, did you ever try the, so um, the Christmas cookie... The or the what are those called? What are what are those Christmas trees? Wow. Christmas. Okay. Thank you all. Um, the what ice Christmas, Christmas tree cookie. What did you just get? The little Debbie Christmas trees. Oh yes, the Christmas tree cakes. So uh, the Christmas tree cakes. Have you ever had the Christmas tree cake ice cream? Yes. Yeah, That's good. That's good. I, I had, and I tried to get some. Did I ever get be free and free like theirs? I feel like too much happened and they never got it. Well, but I got one probably for them. A good old layer of frost. Too much happened. Well, I'm yeah. Uh, I I think like I was out of town, then they were out of town. I got COVID, and and then it was and, not ooh. Christmas anymore. Ooh. So I am uh, for the listeners. I am showing a Christmas nutty nut. What is it? Nutty nut, buddy. North Pole nutty buddy. North Pole Nutty Buddy. Oh yes. But a Nutty oh. Buddy is like a is Nutty Buddy is just like a Debbie cake, a, a little Debbie girl regular. 
Okay. Yeah, it's a nut. Yeah, there's a nutty buddy is usually <laughs> chocolate. Casey the expert. Oh, I thought you were telling me. Uh, like, nutty yeah. buddy oh. is usually chocolate with, and it's like in between those like wafers, you know, the wafer mm-hmm. cookies, as you, the waffly wafer cookies. Yes. So it is coated in this beautiful white chocolate with some yeah. red striping. Does it have any sprinkles or no? No sprinkles. Just uh, no sp- smell it for the. Here we go. Yeah. Oh, you're- break it. Yeah, just break it. Let me turn on this original sound so you can really hear it. We can hear. No, it's gonna. Okay. Oh. Wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> <laughs> now let's get that crunch. Couldn't, can't hear. We didn't hear. Damn, girly, nothing, not a thing. Okay. Oh, wow. oh, there oh I can hear the wafer cookie. Yeah, mm-hmm. those air bubbles. Mm-hmm. Okay, that's enough. That's okay. enough. Mukbang. But that's between enough. this and the rabbit story last week, Miranda's done. <laughs> <laughs> Girlies. Oh my god! And then Adam, after listeners, so after this, oh wait, was that on Close Friends? I don't remember. Doesn't matter. After Adam's story about finding the rabbit oh, okay. carcass, he found another dead rabbit and sent a photo rabbit. in the group chat. But I was like, "What is this a photo of? I don't understand." And I zoomed up so close to see this dead rabbit, and I like threw my phone. It was disgusting. <laughs> disgusting. He even- he I even, even hit, hit the photo. I know. And I was like, what is it? I cannot see. <laughs> Let me see. <laughs> no. It's oh, okay. Man. RJ had it worse. I, I FaceTimed he him. He FaceTimed me. Oh, my and God. And showed him in real time. <laughs> I, no. And I hung up immediately when I saw what it was. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm oh. reporting live here from the Imagination Institute. Uh, some exciting. Some exciting news this week. <laughs> a, le- a a reels tiktoks the disney parks account posted a video of figment walking into the imagineering building in california in california well can't be here can't be florida because there's no imaginary building one. <laughs> so, um i'm gonna say this don't hold your breath that is my advice to everybody who's hoping that it's going to be we're bringing back Dreamfinder and we're <laughs> doing the damn thing. Don't hold your breath. Don't That's hold a- your breath. He's getting a second sweater. That's what it is. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Wonder uh-huh. if the they holiday said, sweater they will break costuming- out. Uh, a new <laughs> you got to go to costuming over on the West Coast. We don't got your size here. <laughs> Isn't Hatbox Ghost coming at the end of November? Quote unquote, end of November, which is nearing. Casey, I listened, to, I finally listened to the Haunted Mansion episode. Oh, yeah. Um, Our Haunted Mansion PCR. episode? Ours? Oh. No. No. From Adam's not in close friends. From Podcast the Ride. Yeah. And how they, I didn't, I didn't think it ended where they, I mean, they did the bit of like Scott like goes through the rest of the ride yeah. but it still felt like they're gonna keep doing it every year yeah i think they will too i don't think they were like done done but that's all yeah so figment <laughs> and the people are saying oh it's because there's gonna be a figment movie seth rogan who obviously i trust with the figment ip seth rogan, <laughs> big figment why. fan yeah you know you know, um, the lore of him visiting Epcot as a child and saying, I'm going to make yes. a movie about you one day. There's, they're they're <laughs> going to create a, a bunch of original characters that went to Epcot as children. And that's their backstory for the <laughs> for the ride. Um, yeah. So allegedly it w- uh, nothing can even be alleged because it's just it's just a TikTok that it's just a TikTok that truly could just be. They were like, oh, he's the imagination character. The building's called Imagineering. That's the through line. <laughs> like, it yeah. could just be absolutely nothing for the parks block. But what you know. account was it on? Was it WDI? Disney, Disney Parks. Parks. Disney Parks. Disney Parks. Okay. Mm-hmm. And we know their marketing is top notch. Mm-hmm. Oh, so. yeah. Yeah. 
weren't they the ones that that gave the like thing that the gingerbread man was the first original character since figment i think they were the ones who provided that uh that piece of intel that tidbit yeah someone on i don't know it was someone on social wasn't it it was someone on social but i think they were like oh we got we got that like for, that's what we were told from blah 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 i think is what happened. i think i missed that i no yeah. uh freelac told us freelac freelac shared something <gasps> hi, hi Kuya. who's she yeah Kuya, Kuya, wave wave hi Hi. Hi. You got to switch. Hi. 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 Um, to any, to, wait, I have to tell the story just to anyone. And, and I tell it all the time. But it's, it's, Chris, it's, Christmas. It's, Chris, it's Christmas Eve 2019, I believe. Mm-hmm. And I'm having, I'm having a beautiful Christmas Eve <laughs> with RJ Adam. And RJ's mother and RJ's brother. And I've been with them all evening, eating, <laughs> hanging out, uh, watching them open presents. And, you know, a couple hours later, RJ's family is going to leave. And they're, like, saying goodbyes and stuff. RJ's mom, RJ's brother are walking out. And as RJ's brother is at the door, turns around looks and points at me and says who's she <laughs> <laughs> like i haven't been there the whole night the whole time <gasps> and then and then are just like oh, wow. oh, and adam has set oh. his background to the scene of the crime the scene there of the crime the scene of the crime have a cookie wow. I miss for only twenty four hundred dollars you can also see you too can you have too. you Go. too can have carpet in your uh, central florida apartment you too uh-huh. can do that you too can do that or you uh-huh. can stay at the brand new resort right across the street that should be opening in the coming months with the water <laughs> Friedrich. adam just like looked as if it was like across the street yeah like oh there it is yeah, one of my neighbors the- drove off with his trash on his car again oh. <laughs> The amount of times that I, I personally that have seen Miranda that happen, has been in town Witness. for it to happen. And it all these people like just the driving off, and Every I'm like, time. "What are we? How do you forget? You're literally right here." I don't understand. Anyway, um, um, I'm looking up two bed, one baths right now oh, um, at at Abaco, and it looks like a lot of people are moving out of apartment uh, building five. Which is kind of sketchy. It's like, why is why are all these people leaving at once? Or, um, but anyways, most of them are going for nineteen forty a month. Um, or but there is one going for seventeen thirty five, and it makes you wonder why is that one Who only seventeen? Yeah, Who died? Like, they're like we're Who not going to re- or we're what not car replace the carpet? Through. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Because remember, we've been hit by lightning, like those buildings, many times. Ooh, yeah. Many times. <laughs> many uh, times. Why did these say diamond upgrade? They're, for some reason, these have a diamond upgrade for the ones that are 1900. And the one that isn't 1900. But whatever. Those so. are one beds, though? No, they're two beds. Oh, wow. For just, there just you seven, go. That's not so bad. Seven, no, seventeen thirty-five. I mean, honestly, no. that's that's like that's what, not bad. Again. Yeah, let's go back. That's let's like what Austin back. is. Let's go back. Let's. It's go also off back. season though for apartments. Oh, that's true. It looks let's like there's go back. Back to back the to beginning. The... And back to the. Um. I mean, any, anything I... else? <laughs> um. Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, what do I call? Um, got, what have you got? What have I got? Um, I did. I got on my switch yesterday and visited <laughs> my island, and yes. um, it had been a couple months since, <laughs> since I was last there. I missed my birthday. I missed Lucky's birthday. Oh uh, man! Yeah, oh, no. Lucky's Reese's birthday is birthday, Halloween. Though. Huh? Lucky's, Lucky's birthday, birthday is, is like Halloween? no, it's like November fourth. Oh, I always thought it was Halloween. No. 
He's still a Scorpio, though. So. <gasps> Speaking of switches, oh my god. Okay, so I've been playing Dreamlight Valley, all right? And when I had COVID, I was playing it a lot. Like, I was just laying in bed playing. And I was like, I am determined to get enough Dreamlight to finally open all of my lands. I put in, I am not kidding, like five hours to get all of this Dreamlight to open my lands. Doing I, the, the stupid tasks, was like the, running yes. around. And I was like, yeah. my last one was the Forgotten Land. So it was like, you talk to Fairy Godmother and you have to like do all of this stuff before it, like, whatever. I must not have cloud saved it because the next time I get on the switch, it was like cloud save. And I was like, yes, I go back and it didn't save a damn thing. Literally the entirety of when I had COVID and put in hours, hours to this game, it lost it all. So I haven't touched that switch since. I'm wow. surprised that it's still in one piece I'm, and you didn't I am so throw it across thrown out the, the window. I couldn't. We just got new Joy-Cons, you know, like. Mm. And, and it's, that's it such was, a process. It's Jace's Switch because I like to play with oh. the normal uh, one instead of the light. Hand, yo, yo, handheld Switch. My digital, my digital hands. Oh. <laughs> I think I hear it's her. It's like she just saw. She's like, fucking oh, oh Win Winifred. Winifred? Winifred? Um, I do see a little shadow. Well, I bought a game when RJ left. Adam bought a game, and I like. Found oh, you you Casey. saw you saw which one I bought? Because I got the receipt, and oh. I was like, "Oh, I literally got the Casey, receipt." I was like, "Someone hacked into my PS account." <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Tell her which and game someone I did. Someone did. Adam has bought mm -hmm. Five Nights at Freddy's. Oh I my god. What? I bought her. Not the... oh. 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 Speaking of Freddy, she, she wasn't crying. She was passed out and I woke her up. So. Five Nights at Winifredi's. The movie? The game. No, the game that the movie is based game? on. It's based it's on. Based Girl, on that's game. the whole reason they made the movie. So, oh, okay, I so thought it's... it was just like an original idea and they wanted to give the Josh Hutcherson or whatever his name is. So a it's a like daddy a... role. It's like a game, like, this is what I know of the game. It's just like a, you, it's like a Chuck E. Cheese, right? And it's, you are yes. like the what, what, it, stop, of it. stop, 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 stop. What do you think the gameplay of this game is, RJ? I think it's like your typical, like, first person view. So it's just like you going around and it's what, it's like a horror game. So everything's dark and then you just try to, I don't know what you're supposed to be looking for, but you just try to survive. Let me tell you that that is also what I thought this game was. Oh, that oh. is not what this game is. Oh, so the game is you are hired as the security, the nighttime security guard at Freddy's, F F whatever, Freddy's, Freddy Fazbear's, Fazbear's F Jollywood Nights. Okay, that's what it's <laughs> called. And you are supposed to get through one week of work, five days, five nights of fr at Freddy's, and you are supposed to last from midnight until 6 a.m. The gameplay, RJ, is you are in the security room. You have two doors, you have two lights, and you have security cameras. The animatronics come to life and you can watch them on the security cameras and you have to close the doors to ensure that they cannot get to you. The problem being is that you only have so much power and the doors are like batter, like powered. They're powered Generated. doors like Jurassic Park, like Jurassic Park. The, and so everything you use takes more power. And if you run out of power, then the doors are left open and you are like fully uh, exposed. exposed yes mm. you do not move in this game you do not walk How you do not you are just in it this was, control panel. it was eight dollars so okay. that should have been the clue and it's really cool it's a really cool idea for a game because it's like it's just fully like beat like learn the patterns of the animatronics movement and then try to like avoid getting murdered and that's it. That's the game. Just last five days. That's it. Um, I lasted all five days because I turned on wow. all the cheats. 
So, other um, mother, cutesy turtles. Mother Lode, yeah. Um, yeah. Yes, Rosebud. Mother Lode, Rosebud. Rosebud, yeah. Kaching. So you can have like your power never goes down. So I just had my doors closed the whole time. I was just like, <laughs> okay. And then you can do like quicker nights. And I think there's another one, but I don't remember what it is. But uh, it's not what I was expecting. And then I was talking to a friend and they were like, oh, what you're thinking of is like they did do a version of that style. And I think it's like security. Secu- it's like Five Nights at Freddy's security systems or something like that. And it is more like first person. You are like walking around trying to avoid being murdered but it's super uh interesting and i um did enjoy myself even though it was not what i was expecting in any way shape or form so oh you're a spooky girl now yeah i got jump scared a couple times i'll say that yeah now you can watch the movie yeah because i had to know i mean there's there's freddy there's chica there's bonnie there's the fox that fucking runs down the hallway and it was the scariest thing I'd ever seen in my life because all the other ones you see them on the security camera and they're just like stuck and they just like you like look at them uh the fucking fox is the only one that like you can see move and it was not that wasn't fun for me. I oh, so you like you don't actually see the move. It's like when you're looking, they're frozen. And then if when you look away. Yeah. If you switch your camera or if they move, they'll like block your the, your cameras will like fizz out. And then you'll uh. like have to find which room they're they've moved to. And they'll just be like in the background. There's like a really grainy camera and you can just see their like silhouette. It's, um, you know, it's interesting. It's not what I was expecting. <laughs> What inspired wow. you to do it to be a spooky yeah. mood? Um, I the movie had come out, and then uh, I think it was just that, and then I think I just like people have talked about it, so I was like, oh sure, we're still in fall, spooky <laughs> season. It's not too cold yet. And now he's right now. Now that this man has talked about it on the podcast, he's writing that off, folks. Say Absolutely. goodbye to that eight dollars. Yep. That's Absolutely. eight dollars. It's sorry, sorry to see. Does anybody have a discounted game available? I hate to <laughs> I hate to ask this I hate question. to ask. Um, did anyone did we have any were people I I didn't expect us to get clap back, but did people like no, also nobody... listen to PTR and we're like, yes, girly. Clap slay. back to us? No, I was no, afraid the, it was gonna leak. The Venn then, diagram you know. does not overlap. Uh, no, besides me, besides and Casey Adam and, and Adam and yes. Relax, yes. I think they Don't. have the Venn diagram. Yeah. No, nobody said anything, but I found I found the Reddit thread. Uh Jeff had or Freelack had sent it to us. Mm. And then I looked later again in the week and it was it's 84 comments long. Last time I saw it. And it was a lot of people being like, this is fucking dumb. Who cares? And then it was yeah. other people being the, uh, like. The, there was people on there that were like, you know what? They probably just make like $2,000 each after taxes. You I'm like, y'all go on Patreon <laughs> and do the math. <laughs> yeah, do the math. And also it's like 20000 does not equate to 6000 after taxes. Like, mama, even if it was a 50%. Could be ten thousand. You know, it's like y'all, whatever. It's if you want to give these these white cisgender men your money, then give it to them. Yeah, give it to them. Give it to I us. still, give I it to still us. listen. We have I, a white cis man here. Slay. There she is. Slay. Slay. <laughs> Slay. The manliest um, of all. I mean, Slay. I still like. I still pay for their Patreon. Like, I wasn't mad enough to do that, but. Yeah, I mean, I I still support them and I still listen to their yeah. shit. Like, I was the biggest PTR. There were, de- girl there were definitely people in that Reddit thread who were like, "It's just the imbalance of power." And I was like, "All right, we don't need to like." Wh- there's a where's the mi- where's the centrism? That's what we're looking for. It's all <laughs> it's there's none. It's all either yeah. this or this. Like, but. and you could say that for literally any fandom or anything. Mm-hmm. You know, what if if you kind of and that's the thing with these you know it's like everyone has seasons in their life where they're real where they're into a thing yeah. and they're very into that thing and then then you go into then you go to a new thing yeah you go you, you go <laughs> yeah you, you leave 
Funko Pops, you can go to Squish Mallows. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You leave Mary Kate and Ashley Olsen, you go to Lizzie Olsen. Like it's just yeah. it's a cycle, you know, you yeah. know. Mm-hmm. Everyone has seasons of life and, you know, and I mean, uh, and like this is so embarrassing, but at a, there has been a time where I saw the PTR boys and after a show, I handed each of them a gift that was a $15 Disney gift card and a little card that said, thank you for everything you've done. Casey, we're not going to talk about past Casey any longer. <laughs> I think I think I past think Casey, just, may yeah. she rest. Let's we, do it. May she rest, yes. Yeah. My let's, next, yeah, next let's bury my next ofrenda for Dia de los Muertos <laughs> is for past Casey. It's, sure. it's on my own Facebook. Yes, post. it's gonna be your Facebook post. Yeah. Have I mentioned mm-hmm. I love this place? Yeah. <laughs> uh, so good. Oh my All god, right. guys. Let's go off, girlies. Go off. Okay. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh yeah. Let's go off. All right. It's time to go orf. Who would like to go? I'll go first. Okay, Casey, yes. it's time to go off. Okay, why are we still hiring Chris Pratt to do voices? Oh, my why God. Why is he Garfield? Like, I'll give you Mario because I don't give a shit about Mario. But you know I give a shit about? Garfield. And I don't want oh. him to sound like Chris Pratt. I want him to sound like anyone else. Like, <sighs> like Garfield is the... Garfield... Garfield is is Chris Pratt when he was fat on Parks and Rec. Garfield is not mm. skinny Chris Pratt that works out all the time and, and goes to church. Goes to church. Garfield don't go to church. Garfield only only supports our Lord and Savior Lasagna. Yes. Garfield, you know, I want Garfield to be lazy, funny, sassy, sassy little fat cat. He's not Chris Pratt. Chris Pratt. Chris he Kevin. is Rat. he is he is not even he's not even like Parks and Rec Andy. He's like season one Parks and Rec yes. Andy when he's like yeah. has his legs Slob. broken or whatever. Yeah, yes. like yes. literally just yeah. he's like a douchebag. Yeah. Yeah. Who would you have preferred? Like if there was one celebrity, no one known name to play Garfield, who would you have selected? <sighs> That's a great question. I was trying to think of that too while I was doing my Honestly, go-off. you could do Nick Offer if you want to go. Nick Offerman. Fuck, fucking yeah, Parks and like Redcast, do Nick Offerman. That's literally, that that's someone said that in a think, comment. When you think of Garfield, you think of Nick Offerman. I because just think he's, that yeah, he's that like. Slow voice, slower. Yeah. He's like. Mm, Garfield already looks like he's a mustache. Great, yes. Another great day. Yeah. Mm, like. Who it's voiced a Nick Garfield Offerman. previously in the old. Oh, it's they, been uh, the same guy for a long it was time. It wasn't guy. somebody. It was like it's like a voice actor. Yeah, Probably Jim in two thousand four, you know? the Garfield movie was Bill Murray. Huh. Oh my god, I forgot He's about still that alive? movie. Yes, Bill Murray doesn't. The, Bill, Blair, Bill Murray's not a bad choice. B- no, no, Bill Murray is not a bad choice. Bill, Bill Murray. And if you're looking for a a a big name, Mama, there you got it. Yeah, Bill Murray. Mama, Mama, there you got mama, it. Mama, there you got it. And uh, come on. I for, I have a feeling that Bill Murray would be cheaper than Chris Pratt. Oh, for sure. I I think Chris Chris Pratt. I keep wanting to say Chris Pratt. I have to Katie Pratt. I think, I you, need to, Pratt, Pratt, I think yeah. you need to be able to prove that you can eat an entire sheet pan of lasagna in one sitting. And I don't mm-hmm. think Chris Pratt does that anymore. No, no he doesn't. I, no. That's not the I same thing. Like, it's the it's the Courtney Kardashian. This smells so good as like whatever you know the quote casey mm-hmm. knows it and yeah what I'm absolutely yeah. i know it. I'm i don't not need talking to say it right it now but you. I know it. <laughs> um i think that chris pratt must have one of the best agents in hollywood i will say that shout yeah. out to chris press chris pratt's agent because you are can staying we- paid Talking about agents, can we just talk about these agents working their asses off? All of a sudden, the strike is over. All of a sudden, these girlies have interviews everywhere. Scarlett Johansson mm. on the Today Show, Ariana mm. DeBose on Good Morning America. Like, they are oh, working overtime. Like, it's, it's like going from but. furloughed and the pandemic back to working, like, 60 hours a week. I bet they're exhausted. <laughs> like, I don't want to do it anymore. I love that the two 
references that you pulled are both Good Morning America and The Today Show. Thank you I for literally, being that's you. That's what she watches. Yep. It was on this most- morning. Miranda's like most uh, consistent commitment that she's ever made in her life is watching. I watch the news shows. in the morning. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Me. I can't. I'm not like Jace where Jace will wake up at 630 and like go continue watching Succession. Like I can't. And part of it. Part of it, and this is just for you guys, this isn't for Miranda. Part of it is just so that she knows that if there is ever another terrorist attack, she is watching it live. (laughs) (laughs) But honestly, like when also, it's not that part of it. It's not, it's not, it's not, not. Did I? cancel going out to watch whatever happened after the boston marathon situation yeah i was glued to that tv we will have, i see um, anything in theaters no, <laughs> will, no. I <laughs> will i sit to, through the fourth hour would do you watch all the way to the fourth oh hour? my god you know no it'll it'll be on but if mm. I like am paying screen, any attention, fourth hour to, is like I yeah. am turning it off because I cannot stand Jenna Boshager. I just, oh like, yes, yeah, oh, no. it's frustrating because I love Hoda. Oh, yes, it really, I, yeah, Hoda yeah. is just like, and honestly, a lot of them really do bug me a lot of the time. So... Sure, <laughs> I like the I like the girl who was on Dancing with the Stars, Amber. No, uh, um. Weather girl, weather girl, ABC weather girl. Yes. Mm-hmm. Oh my god. Z. Something Z. Oh, Ginger Z. Ginger she Z. She was so good too. Breasty, breasty girl. So a, she got the first perfect score woman. of the season. If anybody was wondering, <laughs> she's back on. Wait, what? Sochi got the first perfect oh. score on Dancing with the Stars this <gasps> oh. season. Wait, it took this long for a perfect score. It took score? this long for a perfect score. Sochi, like where they had the Winter no, Olympics girl. in 2014. No, no, no Miss Marvel, Marvel girl. America, Mar- sh- America, America shot. season one dawn. America oh, shot. oh, 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 oh. Anyway, okay, who's next to go off? I can go. RJ, okay, RJ, RJ, go. It's your time to go, go off. off, Queen. I just want everyone to do. If you're gonna. If you're in Chicago and you want to work as a barista, I just want everyone to watch a quick YouTube video on how to make an Americano. (laughs) You have to start with a full cup of ice. You have to start Mm -hmm. with a full cup of ice, full cup of ice, because once you put in the espresso, Miss Mama melts. Okay. The ice melts. I... I'm I'm tired of seeing these girlies who are like, oh, it's espresso and water. Okay, great. That they'll start with the water and the espresso and then add the ice later. And I'm like, no, girly, you have to start with a full cup of ice. And then water, I would say three fourths of the way. Toss in that espresso shot and then it'll be the perfect, the melt, the ice will melt the water will rise it'll meet the coffee perfect and there's still like a good 75 percent to 50 percent ice still in the cup i just am so tired of these girlies <laughs> and there was one time i the dollop at my at my office building katie thank you that's what i told him the other day <laughs> she makes great <laughs> she makes great americanos but they were training someone new and the ice did not come until after. And I was so sad because I was like, the girls at Pret, Pret just reopened and the girls at Pret are still learning all the drinks. And so she was trying to sprinkle in loose ice right at the end. I was like, oh, girl. So. So again, I drink my so Americanos hot. Get, get, uh, order like a quad espresso and just order it over ice. And then figure it out. Figure the ice is going to melt and it basically makes it iced Americano. Right. Just get, want... yeah, just get. You still want what? You still I still want, want the ice, ice in there. I don't want all the ice to melt right And get away. a side of ice. Yeah. 
Do it all separately. Yeah, look do at all like these the girl, solutions. Do like the TikTok. Look remember, at these, do all the, the TikToks. The TikTok. Do like, here's the, but Starbucks here's isn't the, the place you have the hack. problem, right? Get everything as a side. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. I don't have this problem with Starbucks. Depending on, well, t- sometimes it's just when a person's new, you know. But I usually mm-hmm. don't have the problem with Starbucks. Well, yeah, you got to. They got the recipe cards. Yeah, you'll they have to. You'll have to, you know, it's it varies by your location. Some places you want to do it, but if you want, you know what I always say: if you want it done right, do it yourself. Do it. If you, you know if what? you, That's what I do. If you want to get that Dollar General kitty, kitty litter, litter, you just gotta pay you gotta, that extra thirty cents. That extra dollar. Yeah. yeah. Okay, okay, I'll go. Okay. Go ahead, Miranda. It's go ahead, go girl. Over. Okay. It is 2023. You're trying to tell me that in 2023, I can't go to the DOT to renew my license and you don't have the technology to make a fucking license right then and there. I have to wait 14 days for you to mail me a card. Uh, My library, Costco does it. The library does it. What are you doing, DOT? For a renewal. I don't. Everything's the same. The information is. It's a new photo. Put my little gold star on there. I have to wait 14 days. I'm going to have to fly with a fucking paper license. Or my passport. That I don't want to bring to Walt Disney World. Because my license expires on my birthday. And I forgot about it. Anyway. It's just really annoying. I don't understand why we don't have the technology. Or printers for that. Thank you. That's weird because that I've definitely gone to like Florida's DMV and have gotten the card when I renewed. Well, that's really? Iowa, honey. Texas yeah. is it mails just theirs. Iowa? No, Texas mails theirs. I had a paper one in Texas, but Chicago uh, we had a paper one. Chicago we had a paper. I one. did mine was a mine was a renewal and I got it then. Florida, Florida, I think hands it to you there. Yeah, I did, hands Ar- it to you. Arkansas I, hands it to you there. I did get Miss Passport card though, so that way, because I, because we have this real ID that's about to come in Illinois, and I'm like, what? everybody, everybody, everybody. I, but I, I've had the real ID. I don't even know how I got it, but I've had it for the past five years. I've had my little gold star. Uh, mine yeah. was just expiring, and I couldn't do it online. Like I get if you do it online, they mail it, but right then and there, in person. I showed up. Also, I showed up. there Why are a know? shocking, there are a very scary amount of people over the age of 85 that they are giving driver's license to. Oh, um, yeah. it is oh, the, 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 the people going that. up to talk to these DOT people. I'm like, oh, I am never getting on the road ever again. Like, and I'm like, how are, they, no way. how are they passing the vision test? I barely passed the vision <laughs> test. <laughs> And Casey's glasses are this thing. Uh-huh. Yeah. How do you do that? You're like, do oh, you? like one little smudge and yeah. oh man. I have only ever taken one test in my life, and that was when I was 16, taking my test for the first time to get a full license. That's it. I feel like yeah. I had to take a test when I got my Illinois license. I did not. Like, what do and you I mean was test? so taken aback. Like a paper test. I had to take a paper test. And oh. they were like, and I didn't even know. So I like go there to the DMV and they're like, okay, here's your test and your pencil. And I was like, what? So I I've have never, even I've never I even passed. taken, I've never even taken a vision test. Oh, I, oh, said, I, mean, they, do I that. they like, they make you go up to the thing and they're like, read the line. Yeah. They're like, can you see the blinking lights right or left? I don't remember this. Oh, I'm pretty sure huh. they have to, you have to. Well, I'm sure we're going to go off from Adam whenever he has to go again. Yeah, <laughs> to renew. yeah, I can't wait. I guess I should go off. Yeah, let's go off, Adam. Go ahead. Um, Don't be shy. Friedrich, why are you barking? That's my go barking. off. Friedrich was barking earlier, and I don't know why, but it's also hard because I'm wearing headphones, so I didn't know if somebody knocked, so I got really uh, I scared. Have, I have the one out. Ah. Uh, um, um, I actually don't have anything to go off about other than my job, but I can't really do oh. that on a public forum. So, what a pleasant week you've had, Adam. Had Adam, 
Adam got a is now that I'm free from <laughs> now that he is I free dropped from RJ off clutches. at the airport and I went straight to McDonald's and I had Domino's for dinner, honey. I said wow. I'm back on my bullshit. I'm on vacation, baby. <laughs> I'm living for me. That's yeah. just like when when Freelac leaves and Beefried has his yearly Domino's. You have your little nasty dinner by yourself. Yeah. It was great. Dipped it right nasty in that ranch. Dinner. Wow. Nasty dinner. Yeah, that's it. That's us. Lovely. That's all from us this week, girlies. Girlies. What a week. Girlies. What a week. So when is jo- your Jollywood Nights is in two weeks, correct? So we'll hear about yeah, it. Yeah. So we'll record once more um, prior to me leaving and then. We'll we'll tune in next week if any updates have been made. If anything has been solved in seven Yes, days. I am intrigued to see how this week's. So tune up, uh, turn on all of your Google alerts, girls. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Check the check X. Check X. Check but X. we won't hear Miranda's report until December, and that's only if oh, you're subscribed if to you're the Patreon. Only friend. our close friends, girls. Only our closest close friends. friends. And honestly, y'all, this this past week's close friends i mean it's some <laughs> of our best work we've ever done it? <laughs> we've it done is, rave reviews oh my i made joe listen to it in the car and he anytime one of the Ooh. characters chat talked he was laughing he i was, think this was my problem was, about it I'm a character actor, and I was the straight you actor the straight in this actor. little bit. I know we forced <laughs> you. Was, I uh-huh. and that's why I'm like I hate this. Why do yeah. I have to play? You were the, the straight stand- girl. You were the Sandra Bullock to our Melissa McCarthy in Heat, and that pains me so. <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, it was um, very fun. It was really, but you'll fun. want, and also I think the next one we haven't recorded it yet, but I do feel like the next close friends episode to wrap up November is going to be good Ooh. because I'm oh. not in it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that's exactly oh. why. That, that's, that's probably why. Because no. <laughs> it's going to be us talking about you. So the case RJ, episode. RJ, make sure we title it Casey. Don't listen to this. Don't episode. Listen. <laughs> Very boring. No, no. Very topic. boring. Nothing. <laughs> no need nothing. to open. No yeah. need to open. Uh huh. And will you have a will you have a holiday single writer for Miranda and for the oh viewers for the, for oh the close God. friends? I'll have to. I gotta look through my files. I've been trying to <laughs> figure Gather. that out. You know what's uh-huh. funny is that earlier this week I was gonna make my go off about the Wiley E. Coyote situation and then like two days ago they were like actually Warner Brothers is now shopping it around to sell it to someone to distribute. So now I'm, I am feel better again. There we go. That's good. Save filmmaking. Yeah. yeah. Anyway. Save thanks filmmaking. everyone for listening and don't forget Bye. to read the group chat. Bye-bye. Bye. Bye.